did not see that coming. I did not see that coming. Save us! Be gone. And don't ever come back. <laughs> What's good, man? You like my new look, man? You know what I'm saying? Let's go with this right now. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Ah, uh, let's do this, man. Leg up. See, I thought Siri could stand to wait a little longer. It's uninstructive, not to mention unreasonable. Wanna stay with you, baby? Wanna stay with you, baby? <laughs> I missed you a lot. And I missed you, but we'll have plenty of time to make up for that. Okay. Go and train with her, then come back. It'll give me a chance to put my face on. Of all the women I've known, you're the only one who does that before. You've known many. What's it matter? Only ever thought of you. Okay. What we gotta do? Witcher's fast asleep. Ciri's disappeared somewhere, of course. I'm excited, man. Guess she prefers practice to theory. Hmm? Why? Time to wake up, Master. These lessons so boring they put you to sleep too? Damn it. Better taking notes on ghouls and owl ghouls. Wanted to rest my eyes a bit. <laughs> Making her slog through that brick? No wonder she took off. John of Bruges lacks flair, true, but he's reliable. 
Not like the hogwash they print nowadays. She's tackling the pendulums, right? How many times do I have to tell her? Don't train alone. It only embeds your errors. Bring our young damsel to the lower courtyard. She wants to practice, she'll get to practice. Uh don't get mad, she cool, man. Don't get mad at her. Yeah. Why the hell not? The whippersnapper refuses to do as she's told. You like that about her? <laughs> Fine. I suppose I'm partly to blame. But this has to end. Now. Killing monsters is not something to be taken lightly. Siri must understand that if she's to become one of us. I'll see you below. Okay. See why you were so eager to practice. Strike. Whoa. Wow. You're not in this circus, pirouette. Wrong. Footwork. Get down. With a flip? Yep. What do you think? Yep. <laughs> All right. Take off the blindfold. You've got work to do. Your reflexes are still slow. Maybe for a witcher. Think drowners or striggers will go easy on you because you haven't undergone the mutations? Though in your shoes, I'd fear Vesemir more than any strigger. Disobeying his instructions? Unwise. Well, yes, but that book was horribly dull. I know, and you know that's no excuse. <sighs> I'm sorry. It won't happen again. <laughs> Sorry's not good enough. You're gonna read Ghouls and Al Ghouls in its entirety, appendices included. No, please! I'd rather clean the stables. Mm. End of discussion. Come on, we'll practice with the others down below. Shall we run the walls? Uh, uh, nah, nah, not this time, man. Not this time. Believe me, you don't want to keep Vesemir waiting. Yep. Uh huh. Yo, I'm loving this, man. I'm loving this, man. Anything to say for yourself, young lady? I'm sorry. I'm very sorry, Uncle Vesemir. Young blood craves action, I understand that. But when you fight a beast, knowledge counts as much as your silver sword. At the very least, you ought to be able to tell a ghoul from an owl ghoul. By markings, like unto the panthera tigris that in Zeracania dwells, and by the sickly paleness of its visage. Mm. So you did. Read the chapter. Still, you should have asked if. But you were asleep, Uncle Vesemir. <laughs> Don't try to weasel your way out of this. A witcher must know how to trick his opponent. You said so yourself. Might have. But don't use my words of wisdom on Vesemir, got it? That's playing with fire. Fine, we've talked enough. Geralt, you're with me, Lambert with Eskel, Siri with the dummy. <laughs> Again? Stop groaning and grab a sword. What do you think? Should we start by reviewing the fundamentals or go right to free training? Man, I ain't got time to train, man. I ain't got time for that, man. Let's skip straight to free training. No point going over the basics again. 
Yep. Set it to polishing all the swords in Care Moy. Find that helmet. Where you at? Come back. Siri. Siri, come back. I did not see that coming. I did not see that coming. Oh, what the hell? You all right? <laughs> Had a nightmare. About? Sir. It'd take forever to explain. Dawn, some way off. We've got time. Started in the guest room at Kaer Morin. I was relaxing in the tub and next to me... Triss? Yennefer. Funny, isn't it? She's never been there. Seems so real in my dream, though. Was she nagging you about something? <laughs> mm -hmm. so True to life, indeed. We'll find her. In the dream, I went and found Ciri. Then we trained. Those were the days. Hmm? Little she-devil. I've trained kids who were faster, stronger, but none had her character. Didn't end well, did it, your dream? No. A wild hunt appeared, attacked Ciri. I couldn't move, stood there like a stump. It was just a dream. That's the problem. It was more. In the past, when Ciri would appear in my dreams, something was wrong. She was in danger. We taught her how to defend herself from anything, wraiths included. Time to go. Let go. She'll be alright. Be dawning soon. Time to go. Wait. Show me the letter from Yennefer. Might have overlooked some hint in there. Didn't overlook anything. We were meant to meet in Willoughby. That's what she wrote. Meanwhile, one army or another burned the village to the ground. All we can do is follow her trail, so... Stop talking for a minute and give me the letter. Well, how about that? It does smell of lilac and gooseberries. You were gonna read it, not sniff it. We must meet soon. Willoughby near Vizima. Hmm. Nothing else to guide us there. What's this postscript? I still have the unicorn? That's private. <laughs> no, no, let's, let's do this. 
Stuffed unicorn. Used it once or twice. In certain situations. Hmm. The things young folk get up to these days. Back on topic. How's it look? How far behind Yennefer are we? Two or three days. Trail's fresh. But it looks like it leads towards the main road. Could be muddled there. Wait, hear that? I, hear it. I smell it. Ghouls. Okay. Necrophages follow. Let's go before any more show up. This sorcerer I knew couldn't stop talking about how useful they are as creatures. Because you can brew potions from their blood? <laughs> no, because by eating rotting corpses they prevent epidemics. Hmm. Did he know they eat the living as well? No. Really upset him too. His theory collapsed. War is not exactly going our way. We have a side. The Northern Realms. Radovid's realms, don't you mean? Tamaria and Edern are no more. Radovid's pledged to restore the old borders as soon as he wins the war. Believe that? <laughs> Gotta believe something. That's what keeps us going. <laughs> we going? That was close. I was sure I'd end up like my mare. Yeah. Provided you got lucky. Your horse died quickly, but griffins like to toy with their prey. Eat it alive, piece by piece. Oh. You'd... you'd like a reward, I suppose. Yep. Yes. Could always use a few crowns. Thing is, I have a meager purse at the moment. Nilf Guardians requisitioned my goods. Now this. Here. Thank you. I need that. Back to the trail. Like I said, leads to the main road and ends there. Muddled. You seek someone? Yeah, the woman. Yes, a woman. Medium height, long black hair. Seen anyone like that? No. But there's an inn here in White Orchard. Soul one around gets its share of travelers. Perhaps you'll learn something there. Not a bad idea. 
Especially since that wound needs cleaning. Ah, beast barely grazed me. But sure, could use a good rye. Nice and cool, you know, straight from a cellar. Let's go. <laughs> Exactly. In the forest to the mountain shore, but here? Near the main road. Maybe it's the war. Corpses everywhere, the stench of blood, burnt flesh. Drives monsters crazy sometimes. Okay. Men, too. We need to watch ourselves in White Orchard. And we should leave as soon as we learn it. The Temerian lilies, they've a right to hang there. This ain't Temeria no more, old man. It's Nilfgaard now. My arse it is. Drink with weaver lost freaks. Beg your pardon for those thugs. No need. We're used to it. Folk are jumpy around here. Armies just passed through. Now a griffin's prowling about. Mm hmm. Already had the pleasure. One mean beast. Mean? Light way for a hunter to put it. Claude Lena so bad, pulled things one foot in the grave. That does no good to wallow in misfortune. How can I be a service? With a drop of vodka for me. And you? Something to wet your tongue. Um. Nope. Okay, I got you. Uh. Looking for a woman, raven-haired, violet eyes, dresses in black and white. Riding in from Willoughby. And, uh, strange as it sounds, lilac and gooseberries might have smelled that. I've not seen nor smelt such a lady. Believe I'd remember. Yeah, especially hard to forget this one. Plenty of travelers about, though. Folk from all over. Might be worth your while to ask after her. Okay, thanks, that's it. That's all I need. Thanks for everything. Master Witches, would you be of a mind to kill the Griffin? Beasts are scourge on our land. Only killed livestock at first, but it's got a taste for human flesh of late. We're afraid to set foot outdoors. If someone will pay us, won't say no. Please, 
I'm not decrepit yet. Then I'll ask about Yennefer. Mm-hmm. Just remember, we'd rather not draw any attention. I got you. Black one's been out measuring the fields. Let him measure. Better that than burning the harvest. No one's going to talk to me, though. Drommel, you're dumber than a headless cockerel. Why are they marking out them lines, eh? There are four factions. Four what? Factions, teams, suits, similar to club. Looking for a woman. Uh, like everyone. Not like everyone. And not just any woman. Mine smells of lilac and gooseberries, dresses in black and white. Two schnapses. <laughs> It'll lift your spirits. Okay. I ain't got a pit though, right? Fine, I'll have a drink. Can we cut to the chase? You seen her or not? Yennefer of Wengerberg. Never mentioned her name. Yet you described her perfectly. And once I hear something, I never forget. Good. Can't help it. How do you know Yennefer? What a question. Master Dandelion's ballads, of course. The only way a humble merchant might hope to rub up against greatness. Unless, that is, he's as lucky as I am. And runs into a very patient witcher. It's a Geralt of Rivia himself. The Butcher of Blaviken. Ah, where my girl You seen Yennefer? Deepest apologies, but I must ask. Is this about love? Yes, yes, uh-huh. Guessed it. It's love. I knew it at once. What do you know? Tell me. Before you appeared, it never occurred to me that might have been Yennefer. Who would have thought? Get to the point. An elf guardian scout from the local garrison saw her. Where? At their camp. She rode in there. Dark of night, black and white, gooseberries and... Yes, I know. Had a terse exchange with the garrison commander and raced off. Where to? <laughs> I'm not omniscient. Ask at the garrison. Thank you. Thanks. We men of the road must stick together. Perhaps one day I'll be in trouble and you'll be nearby to help. Yep, I got you. I think I need a new mic, new headset. I need a new headset, man. Uh oh, uh oh. Done drinking. Mm -hmm. Then fuck off. <laughs> Don't want your kind here. Okay. Okay, okay, I like the sign. Okay. I remember that. Okay, let's try this. Hope it works. I haven't done anything to you, so just calm down. Of course no. No, I, uh, you've done nothing. Horses work in witchcraft. Get him! Oh my I god. Like that Come on. Gotcha.
Yeah, like I was saying, man, I need a new headset, man. Don't touch me. I gotta get a new one. So right now, do this will do. Okay. I'm loving this, man. Medallion's humming. Place of power, it's gotta be. Come on, Roach. Yeah, come on. Move it, man. Move it. Whoa. Move it, man. Come on. Nah, I ain't got time for you, man. Lego. Lego. Whoa, what are you doing? Push up. Alright. I got it. I got it. Lower and I think. Military camp. No locals allowed without the express consent of the garrison commander. I look like a local to you? You look like trouble. Dead wrong. I make trouble go away. I'm a witcher. A witcher? Oh, like Captain you. Peter Sugwin Levy is in the tower. Turn right, past the gate. You black ones aren't so scary after all. Can even be nice if you want to. Don't get accustomed, Nordling. To the tower. Go. Okay, okay. Goltai Skrife is We must requisition the ship. How much grain will your village give? Whatever you say, Your Excellency. Look at my hands. Look. See the calluses? These are not the hands of an excellency, but of a farmer. So we speak peasant to peasant. How much can you give? Forty bushels. There'd be more, sir, but our lads, the Temerians, that is, took from us earlier and... You will give thirty, and that will do. Let us settle on it, and I wish to see the transport soon. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you kindly. I summoned only the Elderman and the Smith, Willis. But it is said he is a dwarf. You are too tall to be him. Very perceptive of you. Geralt of Rivia, Witcher. Vatgarn. This explains why I did not hear your footsteps. What do you seek here? Yennefer of Vengerberg. Where was she headed? That is a military secret. Haven't thrown me out yet. Haven't called the guards. So go ahead. What's your price? There is a griffin in the area. Slay it. And then I shall see what I can do. Gotcha. It's a deal. Some questions before I start. Know where the griffin has its lair? It kept to the vulpine woods at first. I sent a patrol there, five young men. A hunter found them two days on. They only recognized them because they wore our plate. Since then, the griffin has grown bold. Attacks in villages, fields, on the main road. Meaning it's abandoned its lair. Gonna have to set a trap. I judge from your tone this will not be easy. What do you require? Uh... I'll need bait. A specific herb. Buckthorn. Scent should lure the griffin from ten miles off. Buck... Buckthorn? I do not know this. But I am not yet fluent in the common tongue. Mm-hmm. Probably mastered the basics, though. Hands up. Kill them. No. First came idioms. Don't play with fire, for example. 
Go to Tomira, an herbalist. She lives near the crossroads. She will aid you. Need more information about this griffin, its sex, why it's abandoned its lair. Shall I bring you witnesses? They won't say anything I don't already know. I need to go where your men died. Look around. What's the name of the hunter who found them? Mizlov. He has a hut south of the village, very near the wood. Helpful fellow. A little strange, though. Okay, that's it. See ya. Tamira and Mizlov. Thanks. Okay. Soon the actor. Okay. Where we supposed to go? Right? Come here, boy. Where I go? This one is close by. This is close by, okay. Come on, Roach. Where we going? Where, where, where? That's too far. Where? Right here, okay. the beggar tickets the red bloom well well one versed in herbs probably saying too much but i know a bit for instance that beggar ticks poisonous in large doses small ones soothe pain and bring forth pleasant dreams which is all i can hope to do for her okay looking for buckthorn know if it grows anywhere around here hmm bottom of the river where the channel's widest but you do know that once out of the water... It'll stink worse than a weak old carcass. Yep. Counting on it. I'm hunting the griffin. Need the buckthorn for bait. I was thinking... A few years ago we had trouble. Drowners under the bridge. A whole village had to pitch in for a witcher. Who now can afford the bounty on a griffin's head? Captain Peter Sars... something something. Ah, good to know the black one's looking out for our welfare. Yep. Doubt Emperor Amir cares about you, but this captain just might. Seems like a decent man. There are no decent men in the army. There are only orders. Not from here, are you? A lot of bitterness in you. Too much for someone who spent her life in a hut in the middle of nowhere. True. And you're in a hurry. Elsewise you'd not use bait, just wait for the griffin to attack again. Believe we could have an interesting conversation. Maybe next time. Ooh la la. 
Be trying to hit every girl you see, man. Being too nice. Uh, smash. Uh huh? Come here, boy. Where you at? There you go. Let's go. Let's do this. Come on. Fresh. His love just left home. Okay. Nice. Nice. Which way? Oh, right here. You, Ms. Love. Shh. Hear that? No. Wolves? No. Wild dogs. Yes. More dangerous than wolves. Hmm. I'm hunting bigger game. The Nilf Guardians the Griffin killed. Where'd you find them? Ah, I see. You a Witcher. That monster slayer they's talking about in the village. <clears throat> Show you sure, but uh, I gotta kill those mutts before they hurt someone. Will you help? That is, if you don't mind blunting your silver blades on them. Why not? Sure, Griffin's not going anywhere. No, dogs might though. So step careful now. Come on. These dogs been a problem for a while now. Since the war started. Soldier on the march, he'll stop to rape a woman, strangle her, kill her man for a chuckle, even butcher a cow. But a dog, a kick in passing, no more. I know that. So these stray mutts form packs. They're gaunt, gut stuck to that too late. Attacked another one. <laughs> Get off me, man. Uh, uh. Served at the Lord's Manor together, where the Black Army's encamp now. He was a stable hand, I was the Lord's hunter. But that was before. Well, a long time ago. Okay. Sorry. Hope you weren't close. No. Not at all. So, can you show me where you found the Nilf Guardians? Griffin. Know anything about it? Uh, not much. Not my kind of game. You're his kind, though. Survival instincts alone ought to make you care. I walk silent through the woods. No griffin can hear me nor spy me. Good to know. Good to know.
Good to know. It was here. One lay there, by the stump, headless. The other hung from a branch, guts splayed, stretching down to... Watch out for yourself now. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Not the first griffin I've dealt with. Not likely to be the last, either. Hope you're right. Good hunting now. Thank you. Thank you. Guardians were celebrating. Griffin interrupted them. Grounds black, saturated with blood. A camp. Where are we looking for? are older and deeper heavily armored elf guardians probably okay this way thank you can I climb up so where are we going? This way? Okay. 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 Where? Where are we going? Right here? Okay. Where are we going? Right here? Okay. Where are we going? Where are we going? Right here. Where we going? Where we going? Okay, where we going? Where we going? Somewhere over here. Oh, be doing a little better on the way. Oh, oh. Griffin's nest. What remains of it, at least? Corpse is a couple of weeks old. Still alive when the griffin brought him here. Ouch. Took a long time dying. Bones. Horse. Dog. Human. A few months worth. Oh. Female. Larvae and her wounds have already hatched. Been dead at least a week. Other griffin must be a male. Deep cuts over the whole body. Not a drop of blood on the beak or claws. Didn't defend herself. Crept up on her while she slept. Ouch. Beak tips worn. Gray hairs in the coat. Ten, twelve years old. Griffins pair off for life when young. Male must be about the same age. Okay. Thick shaft, dense barbs. Royal Griffin. Okay. Explains why the male I ran into was so aggressive. Hunted the Nilf Guardians down here in the forest first, then started prowling the area. Hey. Hey.
ओके 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 व्हाट वाइन इट ऑल Yep, this this fall anywhere here. Oh, I can get it. Ah, I don't know what to do. I look at it later. So where are we going? Come here, boy. Where are you at? Where are you at, boy? What am I looking for now? Okay, now we're going. Now come here, boy. Hey, I can't see you. Where you at? Slow, man. Take it easy. Come on. Let's go.
are looking for. Oh, okay. That's it. Okay, that's it. Then what we could. Should talk to Vizimir. Okay. That was easy. Come on. Master Witcher, though he... Yes? What is it, Wolf? Got good news and bad news. Good news first. Captain of the Nilfgaardian garrison knows where Yennefer went. And the bad's that we have to kill the Griffin for him. Mm -hmm. What else could he want from two Witchers? Go on. Tell me what you know. Griffin's abandoned its lair. Gotta make a lure, set a trap. And how's that going? Learned some things. It's a male. Had its nest in the Vulpine Woods. The Nilf Guardians burned the woods down, killed its mate, smashed their eggs. Thought they'd fixed things. <laughs> it's always the same. Instead of sending for a professional, they try to do it themselves, only end up making matters worse. Yeah. Yeah. Got the buckthorn. Ought to work like a charm. Powerful scent. More like stench. City boy. Rotting meat, manure, piss, standard smells of the countryside. Remember Tredegor, hunting that zoogle in the trash heap? You spent half the next day bathing, scrubbing yourself. How can I forget? You ever gonna stop bringing that up? <laughs> Fine. If everything's ready, say the word and we'll get to work. Yeah, man. Let's do this. I'm ready. No point in waiting. Let's find a good spot to ambush it. Picked one out already, other side of the stream. There's fields and a grove. Plenty of room and far enough so no one will get in our way. Good. Me there. No. I won't be too there. Which one is it? Oh, okay. How did I do that? Okay. 
Okay, then go to potions. Then about. Okay. Where is it? Where is it? Um. This? Okay, this one. That's it. Okay, can we go? Enough of this. Okay, let's go. What more earnest prophesied for you this hose That wall was mine. Fuck, barely. Damn deal, stick the bark of the trees again. A stream, amber waves of grain. Charming place. Perfect for an ambush. I know how to choose them. So, ready? Yeah. Let's start. Wind's good. Bait's scent will spread quickly. Now all we have to do is wait. Come on. We can cower in the shade of those birches. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. So tell me, once we find Yennefer, what'll you do? Got your eye on a contract? No. I'll go to Kaer Morn. Little early to settle in for the winter. Snows are a way off, yes. And that's what worries me. Nilfgaard's crossed the Pontar in the east. Puts them maybe a week's march from Kaer Morn. If they reach the valley before snows can cover the passes, well... We need to cover our tracks, hide our paths. Speaking of winter and wintering, think you'll come this year? Maybe. Might bring a guest. Crossbow. 
We break him with tradition? Mm. Stop talking. Got a griffin to kill. Oh, watch out! Doing the right. something? What is that? What did I just do? Oh! Oh, okay. Don't let it get away! Come back! Come on! Are you winning? stand to improve some things. Man spends his whole life learning. Not a witcher, unless he doesn't want to live long. But more on that later. Take the griffin's head to the black ones. I'll ready our horses. Meet me at the inn. Gotcha. Come on. 
right here. Okay. I'm going the right way. Yep. Oh no 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 no. You know what? Come on, Roach. Let's kill him. We can do this. I'm not carrying too much stuff. That's it? Okay, come on. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Just still doing push ups? Where am I going? What the hell is this? Roy! You take me for a blind man or a fool? This grain is rotten. I, I didn't know. So, a fool. Damn it, you never learn. Military Codex, Article 2, Section 3. For the delivery of defective goods, 15 lashes with a knout. Make it so. No, no, no! By the gods, no! Ouch. What? <laughs> Guess you've dropped your good uncle act. It was no act. I extended a hand to these people. They spat on it. Could it be because it held the sword that killed their loved ones? Tcha! <laughs> a moralist. And what would you do in my stead? Wouldn't ever be in your stead. Tell me why you've come. Fulfilled my end of the bargain. Your turn. Where'd Yennefer go? To Vizima. She was a day's ride from here the whole time? Under my nose? Might have said so. Yes, I might have. But you would not have killed the griffin. Tit for tat. Halt! We are not done. It's yours, this gold. I would not want you to say you were inadequately compensated. Thank you. Oh, I'm taking it. Yeah, can I see him? Can I see him getting beat up? Where he at though? May the sun shine upon you. Where are you? Where are you though? 
Never mind. Let's go. Let's get out of here. in Vizima. Got a few friends there, so... Something wrong? Look around. Trouble brewing. Let's go. Time we were on our way. Mm-hmm. I'll buy some provisions for the journey. Then we'll go. Geralt, we should stay out of it. Just this once. Okay. Okay. I'll be a nice guy. What happened to the lilies? Took them down. Took them down to hang a golden sun there now. I cannot show to Marian colors. They'll come and burn the tavern down. Maybe it's true what they say. You fond of the Imperials? You Nilfgaard's whore? I'll let that pass. I know grief eats at your heart. You know shit. They hang my sister, dragged her out of the cloister like a dog. Said Nilfgaard's no place for superstition. That they don't fear the wrath of the gods. And you, do you fear it? If not for Annie, your child would have choked on its navel string. You owe your son to let my sister attending to the no. birth. And you don't oh. fear the gods' wrath. You don't <sighs> fear it, you cunt! <sighs> <sighs> Leave me be! Recognize this medallion? You know what it means. Back off. You all right? They say witches steal young'uns. That's true. What'd the Emperor promise you, freaks? Your own land? Like he did the elves once? Get out, all of you. We ain't going nowhere. No. Don't do this. Neither are you. Don't do this. No. I won't back down now. I can see that. No. No. Gone. And don't ever come back. You just saved your life. 
So much for not getting involved. Come on, let's go. I just said your life, me? That brawl, we didn't start it. Excuses, excuses. You've not changed a bit. Hey. Yen? How? I received a report about a witcher who'd appeared in White Orchard. I knew it was you, looking for me. I might have waited until you found me, but... Well, you know me. Patience has never been my strong suit. It's... Good to see you, Geralt. I... I'd even embrace you. Were you not covered in blood? Sorry. Wasn't expecting to see you. To be honest, this isn't at all how I imagined we'd meet. How did you imagine it? He didn't imagine you'd have a Nilfgaardian escort. Don't get me wrong, Yennefer. I'm glad to see you. But I do think you owe us an explanation. And I shall provide it. In Vizima. Ready your horses. What's watch, babe? Spent the last six months in the saddle. Haven't seen you for two years. Can we take a moment to... Sadly, we cannot. Someone awaits you, Geralt. Someone who doesn't like to be kept waiting. Emperor Emir Var Emrys. Or, to those on more intimate terms with him, the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Doubt I number among that group. For as I remember, last time we saw each other, he wanted to kill me. Well, now he wishes to make you an offer. The kind one can't refuse? I didn't, though I could have. It must have been a damn good offer then. Not many things you'd give up your freedom for, and even fewer people. The sooner we set off, the sooner you'll find out. What about you? I'm going in the opposite direction. I somehow doubt the Emperor's invitation mentioned me. Besides, I've got things to do at Kaer Morhen, remember? Yeah, I remember. Thanks for your help, Vesemir. See you soon. How's your horse? Swift? Can't complain. Why do you ask? I'd like to be back behind some thick city walls as soon as possible. <laughs> See you later, man. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Ha ha. Ha ha. Yee, that was nice. Just the beginning, but then. But then. Uh. Oh no! Right now! Oh no! Nice. That was 
Nice. This bard's tale begins near White Orchard, with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover in Europe, the sorceress Yennefer. She deluded him for years, but now seems just a few steps ahead. After many trials and tribulations, Geralt finally learned that Yen was in nearby Vizima. You like that, huh? I know you like that. Hmm. It must suffice. Think of your cares if I'm clean. The gentleman will refer to His Imperial Majesty by his full title or not at all. The gentleman will be seated on the bergère. The what now? In that chair. <laughs> Tatwin, we shave the gentleman's sideburns to half an inch. What's wrong with my beard? Always thought it added to my dignity. It does. Yet it also detracts from your elegance. In Nilfgaard, we consider beards hard on the eyes. Especially beards infested with lice. Been on the road a while. Fine. Do your thing. Tilt your head back, please. And sit still. And prepare to answer some questions. General, I, I am not certain this is the appropriate time. I can't think of a better time. Men turn honest when they feel a blade at their throat. Movran Voris, commander of the Alba Division. Before they take you in to see the Emperor, there's some information I need you to verify. It's a formality. But one that must be seen to. Sure. Paperwork's gotta be in order. So, Geralt of Rivia. Place of birth unknown. Parents unknown. Age unknown. All insignificant details. Let us proceed to more recent events. The siege of La Valette Castle. The fate of the defending commander one Arya. Yep, I remember that. We fought on opposing sides, true. Then we landed in the same dungeon. Arian escaped, set fire to the castle on his way out. So that is how the blade started. Our reports suggested the dragon was responsible. Moving on. You then found shelter in charming Flotsa, and from there made your way to Vergen. My question is how? Yeah, I'll go I got out of Flotsam with Vernon Roach, commander of the Blue Stripes and... A murderer of non-humans. We know this gentleman well, Jack. You forge interesting alliances. Something tells me my most interesting is yet to come. Go on, next question, before my beard grows back in. We shall shave you again if it does. <laughs> Very well. The infamous summit at Loch Muin. You were there. And once again meddled in the affairs of the mighty. I have to say, Trish. The mighty had imprisoned Triss Marigold. Ought to know I care about her, and I tend to rescue those I care about. And so you did, handing Radovid control of the Conclave and Council of Mages in the process. Nilfgaard recently started a war, unprovoked. So do us both a favor and stop moralizing. 
The gentleman must sit still. I'm almost done. I'm afraid I might find that difficult. Because, from what I know, shortly afterwards you watched a defective megascope blow your friend Sheila de Tanserville to bits. Try skip. I skip. I watched her get in the megascope, but ultimately freed her from the trap your man Letho of Gullet had set. Write that down. Hmm. I want to be sure the paperwork's in order now. Well, national interest calls on one to forge difficult alliances at times. Alliances with witches included. No. That an ongoing alliance? What's Letho up to? I had hoped you would answer that question. Ah, so Letho's hiding from you. Must have a good reason. Was there a shift in national interest that might have caused that? I don't know where he is. Wouldn't tell you if I did anyway. Blade or no blade to my throat. I believe that is all. Your signature, please, affirming you stated the whole truth and nothing but the truth on pain of imprisonment or death, etc., etc. Here and... With these formalities seen to, I would ask the general to leave the room. We shall be choosing the gentleman's attire. An important matter, but one that does not require the general's assistance. Shame. I might have given you some advice. So long, Geralt. Good luck with your audience. Thank you. Ooh. Ooh. Feels more like I'm being readied for a wedding. Were that so, I would have prepared the gentleman a frock, a tailcoat, or possibly a dinner jacket. In point of fact, the gentleman will choose from these garments. Okay. Black, black, or black. We do not like garish colors in Nilfgaard. The gentleman will tell me once he has chosen an outfit. Okay. What do I want? That's it, man. We're gonna hand it right ahead. We're gonna hand it right ahead. This is good, man. Good man. Alright guys, that's it man. <laughs> man, this was nice man. This is nice, this is nice. You know what I'm saying? I'll see y'all later. Ha ha. Ha ha. Yeah.